John Bryant joined the club to get into shape too. He's a goal setter. He likes to push himself. That's when he took on the challenge of entering the ring to fight about during a local live boxing event. He won that first fight and fueled him to continue training with the goal of getting back into the ring. How did you find your way to the club, Sean? Uh, I just started uh, a friend of mine um, who's one of Jackie's neighbors, Dave Griffin. He just said uh, he had been working out here for a while and he said, you know, you should come up. We were training to do some Tough Mudder events okay. uh, with Dave. And uh, he said, well, you should come up to the boxing club and uh, it's a great workout. How long ago was this? Uh, it was about 2013. Okay. Found my way up here about three, three and a half years ago. Um, and I've got, I never stopped coming since. Really? Okay. So, so as, uh, I mean, obviously you you fell in love with the idea of the fitness aspect well, of yeah, it? Yeah, and I, I came up primarily for fitness. I mean, I didn't have any aspirations of uh, boxing or, or being a fighter or any of that kind of stuff. But uh, when I did come up here and, and got a chance to go through the fitness routines, uh, first of all, I realized how out of shape I really was, number one. Uh, <laughs> uh, and number two, it was, it was, a, it was a fun way to, to get in shape. Uh, when you, you come into the club, the coaches, all, they, they greet you, they talk to you, you get to know the people here, and it does kind of feel uh, like you're part of um, a family or part of, you know, you're part of the club, you're part of the boxing club. Uh, and it, and it, it, it was just a great way to, to start to get in, you know, in shape. And getting in, like you said, getting in shape, uh, I mean, it's all relative for everybody, but it's not easy, and this is a fun way. No, it's certainly not easy. Uh, it's definitely a fun way. Uh, it's hard. It's it's a hard goal. I mean, the coaches run you through some pretty good workouts up here. Um, I know a lot of them. Uh, they all preach boxers are the uh, the fittest athletes on the planet, and they try to get you there. <laughs> uh, they're running you through the gamut. It's it's huge cardio workout, um, and they even when you're not anything to do with being in the ring, but just working the, working the heavy bags and working on some of the boxing techniques, uh, you realize what kind of efforts involved. Yeah, so uh, for example, because I think this is going to match up with some of the visuals, so I mean you come in and it's, you get warmed up and then like what, what sort of stuff will you do with, uh, with some of the bags? So yeah, you come in, you got you know, if you're here you got maybe 10-15 minutes to get warmed up by yourself and then the, the guys will run you through a warm up, uh, some running around the, around the gym, some burpees, push ups, all the, all the fun things. Uh, then they get on the bags and, and we're doing a lot of boxing techniques. Um, usually they've got the clock going 15 to 30 seconds at a time and you're, you're doing speed punches. Um, some combinations, they, they teach you running through some combination punches, um, some power punching in various formats, off and on, off and on, off and on. So it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, a, and it, it's a huge cardio challenge as well. So, and, and while you might be here for the fitness, just naturally some of that boxing knowledge and technique starts to sneak its way in. It does. I mean, you start to learn some of the techniques. Um, whether you're here to, to learn that or not, I mean, it's, it's still a boxing club, so um, you are learning some of the techniques. Uh, and it's, it, again, it, it makes it that much more of a challenge as every time you're learning, you want to sort of perfect what they're trying to teach you to do uh, and, and it keeps moving forward. So, and, and I've been leading into this, at what point did that sort of click for you where you're like, you know, I kind of like this technical <laughs> side of it too. Uh, yeah, for me, I thought, you know, the more I came down here, the more I saw the guys that were here um, primarily to learn the sport of boxing and, and they're in the ring doing the sparring and, and watching those kind of guys, it was just, just sort of a, an inspiration. And I remember the, the club ran a, a boxing event at the curling club, I think in 2014. There's a couple guys um, in one of the matches there who were in the master's category that I would fit in. Mm -hmm. uh, watching those guys in the ring in a, in a sanctioned match, I just thought to myself, you know, maybe I could, maybe I could pull that off. So, and then maybe I could do that. And then so next, I you did it. Ended up talking to Jackie and I said, you know, maybe put me, you know, we talked and he said, yeah, I can get you on the next, on the next card. So, uh, and I did. So I've been one, one match, <laughs> one bout. One bout. Yeah. And, and so, but I mean, and, and for yourself, I mean, uh, um, I'd already known you from, uh, from the curling club, yep. winning, the, winning the big chief before. That's right. And, uh, Try to so around town, you got a bit of a profile. So was that fun <laughs> to step out there and say, I'm going to do this. I'm going to put myself in the ring. Yeah, and it was, whatever happens. Absolutely, it was fun. I mean, it was it was a huge challenge, uh, f far more intense than than I anticipated. Really, uh, getting in there, but uh, and that's exactly how I went in to approach it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to take on the challenge, and you know, whatever happens, happens. I'll I'll be as prepared as I can be, and we'll learn from it. But is that is that the type of uh, person you are, just going out there and uh, and wanting to, to push yourself uh, yeah, I to think, that next level? Yeah, I think it definitely fits into you know my my life outside the outside the sporting event as well. Just even in business, uh, you know, you got to be looking for different challenges, way to push yourself, way to get to the next level, uh, setting different goals, all those kind of things. And it's sort of the business side translates into the to the athletic side. Um, 
you know, through curling, I mean, started there and, you know, you want to get better and pursue different goals. And uh, I mean, just coming in here as well, same idea. And uh, just, the, you know, the atmosphere and the familiarity around here, you, you just, you want to, you want to just continue to, to get better. But are there two sports that are much different than curling and boxing, really? <laughs> no, yeah, no, I can't imagine two opposite, uh, polar opposites there. <laughs> the, um, uh, when it came to do that and actually step in the ring, was it, looking back though, was it as big of like, because uh, uh, I imagine there was butterflies and nerves and everything like that, but at the same time, it's it really just one more level of being a part of the club and, and fitness, right? Exactly. It's, it's another level of, of being ready and it's I mean huge butterflies when you go in there and, and you do that uh, I mean the best part is you've got a great support system here uh, the guys that have been in the ring who you're training with and sparring with um, are down here getting you ready right I mean they're giving you tips and they're getting you ready to to so when you step in the ring you know what to expect and, and, and you can kind of mitigate those butterflies so I mean having that support system uh, when you're going into your first fight is, is huge and then ongoing from there everybody's here to help out Mm. which is fantastic, whether they're um, just here to help you get in, get in shape, get the fitness level, or whether they're, you're in the ring and you're sparring and they're helping with the techniques and, and getting you ready for the actual fight. So it's, it's a great atmosphere. Do you think you're ever going to do it again? Yeah. yeah. I got, uh, I'm talking to Jackie. Jackie's going to get me about, uh, again, this summer. Uh, we'll get one more. I've got to get a win in the books. Okay. Maybe two, but good to have a winning record and then, then officially right now it's my retirement. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but, but again, it's, it's, it's something that you're, I mean, I'm... Uh, like you said, you just now, it's, it's not like you're looking to turn pro, but no, there's no, still no, benefits to taking it to that extra level. It keeps, and then I'll just, I mean, for me personally, if I know, uh, if I make that commitment in my own mind that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get in the ring again, um, I know the level of, of fitness that I'm going to need to be at that, and it keeps me moving forward, right? It, it, it sets that next challenge for me. So um, it's good for me that way as well.